What's up guys, it's Alex or Aussie Gaming Chick here and today I have a Dying Light video for you guys. Now if you guys go on to enjoy this video, I'd love it if you hit that like button, that'd be absolutely amazing. Now let's jump into this video. So this is going to be a quick update on the release date for Dying Light, uh, particularly here in Australia because uh, the US I believe it was released today so you guys have no issues there. Um, but as you guys might know, a couple days ago I posted a Dying Light uh, delay video um, informing you guys that the physical copies of the game had actually been delayed, but we didn't know exactly when they had been, been delayed to. So we have an official release date for the physical copies, which is going to be uh, February 27th, which is a full month after the original release date was supposed to be, which is actually a lot longer than I was expecting. I was thinking tops you know, uh, one or two weeks, um, but four weeks, that's quite a long time. Um, they haven't really told us why it's going to be delayed by month, but that's what they're saying. They're also saying, though, that um, those that do pre-order the physical copy will get the season pass for free. So I suppose that's a bit of redemption, but I'd love to know your thoughts on that, if you guys have got the uh, physical copy pre-ordered. Um, also, some news on that, um, the... Originally, if you pre-ordered the game, you got the game mode, um, Be the Zombie. This is no longer a pre-order uh, feature. So, Be the Zombie is going to be in the game no matter what. No matter if you pre-order it or buy it later, it's going to be in the uh, game no matter what. So, that's a bit of a bummer. Like, because I know a lot of people actually pre-ordered the game just for that mode, and now they didn't need, need to do that. Um, so, I don't know. It's a bit, a bit all over the place, to be honest. Now, some, real, some information on the digital copies. Now... Um, they said while this, uh, the announcement of the physical copy is being delayed, they did say that the game would have a global digital release of January 27th. Now here in Australia, it's currently January 28th and there is no release dates, uh, release so far. They've posted a update on their Facebook page saying that the digital release, um, on the Xbox One will be January 29th in France, Belgium, the Netherlands and... Luxembourg and January 30 for Australia and New Zealand, um, UK and other international markets. All digital PlayStation 4 releases are scheduled for January 28th. So that's really, really strange for me. I'm not entirely sure why the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4 has different release, release dates. It's really confusing to me. It's a really sort of all over the place um, launch and I'm not entirely sure what's happened. But yeah, so for those of you that were thinking of picking up the digital copy and were looking on the Xbox One store today and we're not finding it, uh, it's because the release dates have been pushed back a day or two, depending on where you are. So I'd love to know your thoughts on all of this. What do you think of the launch? Um, how it's gone about? And, you know, they're sort of, I suppose, making up for it, giving people season passes for the physical copies. I personally, if I had pre-ordered the physical copy, I probably would cancel it right now, get my money back and buy the digital copy and I wouldn't even bother pre-ordering it because you really don't get anything for pre-ordering it anymore. It's really strange what's happening but yeah I'd love to know your thoughts on all this in the comments section below. But yeah that's it for me today guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like I mentioned, please hit that like button and if you're new I'd love it if you subscribe. That'd be absolutely amazing and I'll see you guys in my next video. Alright, bye.